Hi, this is William. In today's video, let's talk about 20 of the essential things that I use for teaching my class each and every week. Number one is a must have for every teacher and that's flashcards. Coming in place number two is magnets. I use magnets to hold the flashcards when I want to display something on the whiteboard for the kids to see. And sometimes also for playing flashcard games. These are really great. Now the next that I use a lot are balls. Balls are great for introducing a lesson. You throw it to the child and you have the child say something and throw it back to you. It's also great for playing games. Something like the sticky ball is really great for playing flashcard games. The next one I have are foamy sticks. A really great way to play games as well. The next is hoops. Hoops combined with flashcards gives you a variety of flashcard games that you can play with your classroom. Next is the hammer. Hammer is great for playing competitive games when kids have to compete against each other. Next is the basket. I use this for carrying things to and from the classroom and also sometimes for combining them with balls for playing games. Next is the bell. Whenever there's a competition, sometimes there needs a starting bell and an ending one, and this is great for that. The Bluetooth speaker is used for playing music when sometimes we, I want to teach them something without having them watch a video. The next is books for planning and also for taking down ideas. Next is the classroom TV, which is essential for watching videos or listening to songs. Next is stickers. Classroom control purposes. This is very important and essential. A variety of them you can pick from. The next one is the whistle. The whistle is similar to the bell and sometimes it's used for getting the kids' attention to start a particular game or end it or get them to be quiet. The next is the marker. Sometimes I have to draw things on the on the blackboard, on the on the whiteboard for the kids. And I use a lot of markers. This is the envelopes that I use for carrying flashcards and for safe storing. Flashcards are really important and we don't want them getting damaged. So it's really good to have envelopes in which we can store them so that we can keep them safely in a place. What is really essential and I need to rehydrate a lot often because I'm always teaching an active class, they are kids, so that's always jumping around. Next are toys. Kids love toys. And toys you can use in many ways, you know, for playing games, for getting the kids' attention, for explaining words and stuff. The next are caps. Caps are also good for playing a lot of flashcard games. Then number 19 is colored balls. These are actually used for grouping the kids into teams. So each kid has a color, uh, a team color, and usually I give each kid a color so that they know where they stand in a team. And the next 20 is my iPad, which I use for, this could be a computer or anything for you, which I use for research and taking down ideas. I did say 20, but this is 21. The office printer, which I use for printing flashcards, for printing uh, worksheets and things that I need the kids to work on in the classroom. And finally in 21, these are the cabinets. These are the cabinets in my office that I use for storing flashcards for storing toys and for storing many things that are really important for my teaching. So, this is it. I'll see you in the next one.